Aisha, uh, for now I can tell you that the fire service personnel have been able to bring the fire under control. Just a few minutes ago, most of the fire tenders left here. The situation was um, a big blur because um, they didn't know exactly what to do. And this evening, you know, because um, there is no light here and because of the thick smoke, it was difficult for them to enter inside and be able to douse the flame. But fortunately for now, uh, we realize that the thick smoke has come down. And for that matter, we are able to see everything clearly. But still, traders are here. Most of them are bent on sleeping here um, and if passing the night here because they don't know what will happen next. Even though, like I said, the fire has been brought under control, the fire service personnel are keeping some of there are men here and the tenders here just to make sure that um, just to make sure that um, they've done the work mm. fully in case anything sparks. Because just some few minutes ago, they bring the fire under control and within two, three minutes, then we also see smoke coming out from one end. So it kept spreading from one shop to the other. So for now, uh, it's a relief for them, even though most of them have already lost their investment. Some of them earlier even managed to enter inside. The fire and the police personnel were trying to push people out, but they were insisting that they go inside and be able to salvage some of their belongings. So, um, Aisha, the good news is that, as we say, uh, the fire has been brought under control. Maybe from tomorrow, we will be able to assess the extent of damage and even maybe get the preliminary cause of the fire. But have you been speaking to the traders? First of all, let me ask if there's been any casualties. And if you've been speaking to the traders and what they are saying, those that have lost their investment. Well, uh, for most of them, they are down. Um, some were even telling me that uh, they brought in new stock just some few days ago, hoping that they will be able to sell and make some profit. But unfortunately, they've lost everything. With regards to casualty, uh, we've not recorded any serious one, uh, with the exception of some one or two traders who collapsed because they couldn't um, contain the pressure, seeing all their wares right. burning or reducing to ashes. But the ambulance were here. They made sure that they gave all of them first aid and brought them back on their feet. Right, Ibrahim. Thank you very much.